This is the test results of a super clean washing machine that I made. Did you ever notice after you, your machine ejects the water for the last time, the water is filthy dirty? Well, how in the world can our clothes be clean if they were just sitting in a tank of dirty water? So I came up with this super simple test. I take a sock out of the machine after it's done washing, and I put it in this container of water for just one minute. Now anybody at home can perform this test too. And you're going to get the same results because all washing machines basically work the same way. They fill the tank twice, they dump the water twice, they agitate, they rinse. Some washing machines will fill and dump a third time called a pre-washing washing cycle. But are our clothes actually getting clean? Check this out. Look at it. Okay, we're at 30 seconds. We'll let it sit in there for another 30 seconds. And then we're going to see what that water looks like. Now, supposedly, that, that sock is clean. Just like all the other clothes in the washing machine. Just like the clothes that you're wearing. They're supposed to be clean after they come out of a washing machine. Okay, we're right about there now. Okay, one minute. Now, we're going to take this out of there. Now this is a, a test that you could do at home and you're going to get the similar results. Look at this. Okay. There you go. I'm going to pour this water into this clear glass here. Let's examine the results of a regular washing machine. Look at that water. Look at all the particles in that water. Now those particles came off of that sock which shows without a doubt that that sock is still dirty and that everybody out there is wearing dirty clothes. Isn't that something? It's just unbelievable. So I'm going to take another glass here. I'm going to perform the exact same test after a sack comes out of my super clean washing machine that I made. I'll fill it up to about the same side, same height. And then we're going to go ahead and put the sack in. The sack has been washed in the super clean washing machine. It's the second one of the pair. So we could uh, judge it accurately. I've got the water level at the exact same height. And the perimeters of the test are the same between my machine and your machine, which is a standard washing machine. Now this super clean washing machine that I made has, I it costs about $80 in parts to make it a super clean washing machine. And I'm using parts that are already existing in other areas and they have a proven track record of reliability. So these parts should last the life of the machine. Well, we're almost approaching that 30 minutes. We got a second glass here that we're going to fill, and we're going to compare the two. Now, I could show you that washing machine, but it looks just like any other washing machine. It's a round box, it's a box with a lid on it. But what's important are the test results. And here we go. We're approaching that minute. Let's go ahead and see what we take that out. Bring that sack out. Here we go. Let's take a look at that water. Look at that business. Look at that. Here's a standard washing machine. And here's the super clean washing machine. Look at that business. Holy moly. That water almost looks good enough to drink. This test proves without a doubt that everybody out there is wearing dirty clothes unless you have a super clean washing machine.